Hey everyone, welcome to Firefall News, the show where I keep you up to date what's going on in Firefall. Um, now we're talking about um, inventory management and migration. Um, since the servers are down right now and they're um, putting the update on the server, there are some things happening with our frames or with our equipment. Um, first of all, um, all our modules slotted into gear will be unslotted automatically without any costs for us and they will be in our inventory as salvage. So we have to salvage them, get back our um, module credits and with these you can buy uh, modules from a vendor. Um, then battle frame cores, since um, cores won't be used in the new build, um, you also have to salvage them and for each core you will get five new items, so one of each, um, head, chassis, reactor, arms and legs. And point three on faded paths list is um, broken weapons and abilities like the Noxious Needler, the Advanced Decoy, the Heavy Rocket Turret, um, the Power Field and all these abilities who are not included in the patch notes for the 1.6 build, all these will also be salvage. So a lot of stuff to salvage and after salvaging all the cores you have 5 items per core. So inventory limit could be a pretty hard thing and so when you log in for the first time your inventory or the maximum inventory you can carry without being overload um, will approximately doubled for 48 hours. So when you log in the first time, don't wonder why your um, inventory increased um, dramatically. This is only for 48 hours um, to make sure that you can yeah, still run around and um, salvage all the things and upgrade and get again some space in your inventory. So um, yeah, sadly no permanent inventory increase but um, at least it's something makes the update um, way easier for us and yeah that's it for now and i see you in the next um i see you in the next video and in game bye